Yes, guys, how is it going? And welcome back to the adventure. I'm sorry there has been such a gap between the last one, obviously Christmas and COVID, but I am back today for the start of an FA Cup bumper weekend. We're going to three games in three days and we're starting at the county ground, Swindon versus City. It's a long way to travel to watch the Blues in the FA Cup, but it's got to be done. We're City till we die. We've got to head down there. Uh, it's a massive, massive game for Swindon. It's one of their biggest games for a long, long time. They're welcoming the home of the Premier League champions and uh, they've got nothing to lose tonight and I'm sure the atmosphere is going to be absolutely top and they're going to bring the house down and give it everything for their team uh, yeah well City are looking to win the FA Cup for the first time since 2019 so uh, it's time to get down there and let's go come on City long drive for me but we're looking forward to it it's FA Cup weekend Okay, so I've hit my pit stop and I've decided to just come off the first exit of the M5 to stop here at the Hawthorns. I've been here twice, uh, saw West Brom, slap Sheffield United and then get slapped by Arsenal. Uh, but yeah, we're here, we're at the Hawthorns, just having a quick look around before we get back on the road and head down to the county ground. All right, we've made it. It was a bit of a crazy drive going through the hills of the Cotswolds. I think it's Cotswolds, but yes, we have made it to Swindon. We're in Tesco and we somehow ended up on the Easter Isle. I mean, it's January. It's three months till Easter, but obviously supermarkets. They're playing Christmas music in September, so can't deny them. But anyway, we are here for ready to get to the county ground. Apparently, it's just over next to Tesco. So I just parked in Tesco because I might as well. And uh, the county ground's really close. I mean, Swindon have got nothing to lose today, so they might as well go for it. And obviously, City need to win today to get to the fourth round. Uh, I would say it should be a convincing win, but you know the FA Cup. Anything can happen. That's the beauty of it. It's going to be a cracking game nonetheless. We've made it to Swindon, made it to the county ground, and talk about old fashioned away end. This hits the jackpot a burger truck in the middle of the corner where we are, port loose, and an eight pound burger. That's called an away day. And don't forget the open top stand. So if it rains, well, we're getting wet. <laughs> but it's an FA Cup away day. It's an experience for us. I'm on the end aisle, and uh, yeah, well, I've been in nicer away ends, i.e., Tottenham. It's cold, but at least the burger's good. Swindon fans are already starting to make noise in the town end, and I think they're going to be making noise for the whole 90 minutes. Swindon versus City, proper FA Cup night on a Friday night. This is ridiculous. I knew Sonny would be up for this, but Flippin' Hector really well off. Yeah. Come on, City! 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 It's a big cup weekend and we kick off with Swindon versus City at the county ground. Atmosphere's electric. Let's go! Come on, City! Come on! Oh! Nice! Oh! Come 
block. Point it back. I got one of all. Oh! Shoot! Oh! oh! Did that go in? Oh, I didn't. I didn't go in. It looked like it did. I can't sell on. Well, it looked like it went in from here and here, like an absolute beauty like it did at Newcastle, but sadder of the net. Uh, a few of the Swindon fans next to us thought that on the stand there that it went in. So, Swindon got away with one there just before half time, that would have been as well. Oh, Gabs! Oh! Good defending. Fair play. Okay, so it's half time at the county ground and it's Swindon nil, City 2. And we got that goal with inside 15 minutes that we needed. Cole Palmer with an absolutely brilliant, Maisie run, pulled it across to Bernardo Silva, he tapped it in. But what a fantastic run from Cole Palmer it was. It was 2 0, Gabriel Jesus coolly finished to grab City's second. Cancelo nearly scored an absolute stunner before the half finished, uh, but it. It looked in. It did look in. Uh, it was just on the wrong side of the post. I'm more concerned about if it rains because we've got no roof on this stand. So a little bit concerned if it starts raining. But it's held out for 45 minutes. And uh, yeah, the atmosphere was absolutely fantastic for 15 minutes for Swindon. And they actually really gave it a go. They managed to um, just hold City to just having some possession. They never really created a major chance other than when we scored. Um, so really, really credit there to Swindon. Uh, but obviously, once that first goal, then the atmosphere kind of uh, got, kind of died off, and City dictated then the play uh, for the rest of the half. Swindon did come close, so Zach Seppard threw the ball out uh, to one of the Swindon players. Uh, I'm really sorry, Swindon fans. I do not know who your number 11 is. I think it's like Mick somebody, I've the guy with the ponytail. He's been good. He's been their best player. Uh, every chance Swindon have had coming forward has come through him. So he's the player to watch in the second half. City just need to keep their composure and grab another few goals. Maybe give some, uh, maybe give some kids a run out in the. 
second half and uh, rest some of the first team for a big match against Chelsea next week. But it's 2 0 City at half time. Good on. Come on, City! Nice. Jesus. Oh! 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 Hit that! Too casual, that I'm afraid. Not a good penalty, not lack of power, but fair play. Good save by the Stanley goalkeeper. That still 3-0. Technically, the Stanley game. Oh, oh, Come on! Come on! Keep going! Here we go! Come on, Kev! Be a bit upset there if I was a Swindon fan. Rodri and Diaz look like they kind of got in between the striker there and he went down. That's I've seen him given on that one. Well done. Cancel, cancel, cancel. Go on. Hey! Oh! 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 Good save. Let's get him. Oh! Oh! Oh. Oh. Come on. Right foot. Oh, trying to walk it in. Go on, Carl. Oh. Oh. It's quite quick actually. <laughs> Where's it going? The county grounds just gone into absolute raptures. His name's McCurdy. I said at half time he was Swindon's best hope. He's got himself a goal. And that town end went absolutely mad. There were flares on the pitch. Fair play to Swindon getting themselves on the score sheet. This place has gone mad. I would have 
look, not going to lie, I would have liked to have seen them score first, actually. would have seen the absolute carnage in the stadium, but it should be nothing more than a consolation, but fair play. Corner. Maybe it's not. <laughs> Come on! Oh, yes! Oh! What a finish! Wow! Set it! Set it! Set it! Set it! Set it! Set it! It's been a bit of a crazy game actually, but what a finish from Carl Palmer. Wow, in off the cross between the post and the bar. The angle looks so acute, but he finished it off. He's been City's man of the match today. What a goal. He's given everything tonight, McCurvy, and he's gone off. But he can hold his head high. He's been brilliant, and he's got a goal to show for it as well. Oh! Oh! He doesn't know where he's going. He's going to kick it out. Oh! Oh, it's still on. Oh, shoot. Oh! There's no goal line technology here, Rodri. What a save. And there we go then, it is finished, my, oh my god, my fingers are so numb, it is so cold here, but it is finished 4-1, Cole Palmer put Bernardo Silva on the plate and Jesus made it 2 in the first half, a Gundogan superb three kick and a Cole Palmer spectacular got 4 for City, Swindon did pull a goal back, McCurvy who was their best player, who I did say at half time, did pull one back. Brilliant uh, effort from Swindon on and off the pitch. Their fans are fantastic and their players gave 110% all the time. They were absolutely brilliant. Credit to them where it's due. But City get through into the fourth round with four goals. Come on. City, we do. Oh, City, we do. City has to play so goal. So that is going to bring an end to today's adventure. We have started in a great way for the FA Cup weekend. We've got two more games in two days to go to. And, uh, well, one of them's huge. One of them is absolutely massive. So hopefully you're going to enjoy those. If you have enjoyed the vlog, make sure to smash like, subscribe down below for more football adventures and to see the rest of the FA Cup adventures pop up in your sub box. It's very convenient, trust me. So hit that big red subscribe button. And I'll see you guys next time. Long way back for me home, but it was well worth it. Peace out from the County Brown fam.